Yeah. What do we got here? Another STC pod pickup video. Both of us involved. Yeah. Because that's what makes pickup videos entertaining when you have two people. Nope. Do you know what that is? Being in front of the camera makes it interesting. <laughs> so that, these are those SingStar remotes. I thought I'd take a little take a little shot. Yeah, I touched that. Someone's probably yeah. Their mouth has definitely been on that. It comes with the uh, the hub that you plug it into, and then that goes into something. Yeah, whatever. Maybe make twenty bucks on that. Also in the baggies, uh, the Bell remote. You know, uh, it looks brand new, but uh, people always need these, especially the UHF version, because when it wears out and you got to get a new one, it's really expensive. So that's always a good find. I haven't even had a chance to look at these baggies yet, but something caught my mind in here, and it's not the crane, although this is kind of cool. No. What is that? I don't want. Hold on. And it's not. This crappy. Oh my god, then don't show it. TF. Well, Steven Eider might like that. Get out of here. Let's see, you got your stuff coming up later. But it's these. What we got here is some of Luigi. And uh, the date on that is 89. Yeah, camera. What a poser. So that's kind of neat. And there's also uh, more junk for your shelf. I think I actually remember this. I know you're jealous. What's the date on that? Eighty nine too. This one I actually yeah. remember. I think I. If yeah, someone's been licking that too, probably I touched that. Yeah. Well, you touched it. Also found this in the baggies. Palm Pilot. Remember those? Yeah, I had one. Yeah, I know I you it. had that on your belt, like Mr. Big Shot. I'm missing the stylus, and I don't have a charger for it, but it's in immaculate condition. I might. I don't know. Hopefully, I'll get something for it on eBay. I still have my. Uh, Palm Trio at home with the charger still. Might be the same. I was also in the uh, DVD section and I found these two of my favorite Monty Python movies in Blu-ray. Pull, pull out, Wyatt. That's what <sighs> she said. Pull out. So special editions here, right? 40th anniversary of Grail and uh, Life of Brian special edition. It's got uh, the film Immaculate. No Marie. one can see that. Yeah, so get in there. Now we got the rev a new revelation. Look so, at those fingers. Yeah, this will be good. I think there was someone did a podcast about these not too long ago. Yeah. I don't remember. No one probably listened to it. I don't remember. But while I'm oh, the, they had five ninety nine on these because they're Blu rays. But if you take that price off, they turn into the price of DVDs. So, uh, I was at Shoppers and saw this. And I went, what the hell for three bucks? Yeah, I know what you saw. Uh, no. What is that? Uh, Iron Man. Who cares about that? From the Marvel Knight series. Who is that? That's Spider Woman. Spider Girl. Woman. Agent of Sword. What a stupid. Yeah, for three bucks, that's Blu ray. So I thought, why not? Why not? Brian Michael Bendis. Really? Yeah, of course. And back to shoppers. I don't remember if I showed this or not, but they were blowing out some of these. This is still sealed. I think. What, do you remember what I said this cost? $10 or something? So, that's a double. Let's go. And finally, uh, in the books section, look at this big honker. Four ninety nine. I can't say that was the original. Might have been some other thing on there. Uh, I, I'm a sucker for uh, for the historical books, right? And especially war books. And this one, uh, Ken Burns is a part of this. Of course, we love Ken Burns' documentaries. Big, beautiful, personal stories of the war. So all the pressing. I had to grab that. And man, look at the retail price on that. Yeah, crazy. Glad I didn't have to spend Cra that. Crazy as you buy all these books. Yeah, I know. You don't even read. Hey, let's take a break and show your stuff. I didn't bring anything today, except my lunch. This is what Joe brought, some dry bread dry bread and a bunch of biscuits well thanks man that was uh your lunch order it'll be in in a couple of minutes pizza's on the way yeah all right hey i got a new uh oh this was you always pick these up right you know what that's for no one's buying those things well 
I always lose mine, I so... a billion of those. You don't even know what it's for. Oh, do you know what that's for? What? <laughs> it's for a controller. Guitar. It's for one of these babies. It's Look at this. It's not the same color. I know, but it'll work. I didn't, I really didn't want to pick this up because these stickers are so freaking hard to get off and this thing is all dirty and gross, but for $2.99, I couldn't leave it there. Ugh, I'm not looking forward to cleaning that up at all. Okay, so there was a new thrift store opening in town. Ugh. So I showed up there with about a million other people. And I thought it was going to be a bust, but I saw a whole shelf of this stuff. Game guides. GG's. See that? Okay, we're up. So, uh, 49 cents each. So I grabbed what I could. Pikmin 2. Symphony of the Night. That's pretty good, eh? Black and white. Who is this? This is Prima's 2. Hmm. Uh, Crash Bandicoot 2. First Pikmin. Ooh, I still got a poster. Shenmue 2. Tomb Raider. You remember Tomb Raider, don't you? Hey, oh, Yo, what the heck? <laughs> this that? is. That's, what is that? It's not part of the game. These are punch outs. Oh, like, punch this outs. is cardboard. You punch this out. I bet you you put these on your mirror when you were an adolescent, didn't you? Of course, when Tomb Raider was out, you were, what, 32 years old? Uh, Mario Party 4. You don't have to show the insides. Yeah, I'm curious if they have. The, I haven't even looked through them. I just quickly grabbed all these, so I'm curious if it has inserts and whatever. No one cares, dude. Still got the poster. I assume that's a map. Vice City. Of course, I played through that. Donkey Kong Country. Brr. Oh, is that your contribution? That's what makes these videos so interesting. Yeah, there's some alright ones here. If you're into these guides. Silent Hill. When have you seen a Silent Hill strategy guide? I don't need one. I finished it, no problem. I don't believe that. You'd be too Fucking scared. smoke those little creepy babies walking through the school. Luigi's Mansion. You what? Play that back. What? You beat them with the bat. Oh, what happened here? Oh, come on, guys. You probably did that. Probably. Rogue Leader. Rogue Squadron 2. Love this game. No, you don't. Yep. Uh, another Tomb Raider. These Tomb Raider things, man. Oh, you seem to like the last one. No, you did. Well, you still have a, something happening in your pants. It's jabbing me in my side right now. Another Tomb Raider. Throw those out. The book. What is this? There's another one underneath yeah. it. Joey's going to upset. Let's go. Tomb Raider 3. It's a big Ugh. close up picture of her. Yeah, don't need to see that. Look at those things. They got bigger for the third one. No one was buying the game by then. Oh, yeah. They were still getting no, it they for weren't. three. Yes, they were. Know. Yeah. Don't know. I do know. Turn what game's this? Oh, this is like a scary game on the GameCube. It's uh, actually a very sought-after game. and a pricey I'm one going to push my glasses up and make stuff up now. With the poster. And pretend like I'm pretentious. Us real gamers actually have this game, which I do. You do not. Musha. I've gone through your shelves. I never saw it. Yeah, I do. It was actually a gift from uh, Cousin Luke. Well, you should check. See if it's still there. <laughs> it better be it's still be there. Didn't we already see this? Yeah, this country. is the Game Boy one. Another Luigi's. Didn't I? Did I show this? Hmm. Unfortunately, you did already. Yeah. I'm seeing this This twice. one's different, though. It's, it's way thicker. That's what... Who said? And Silent Hill. Deuce. There's no way you... I'm going to have to drop a deuce on all these guides right now. You couldn't have played through that. That would be way too scary. I have it. I only played it for 20 minutes because, and yes, it was scary. So, 49 cents each. They so they perceive these as magazines, which I appreciate. And these they perceived as kids' movies, and they were $1.99. So I grabbed uh, another copy of Dark Souls. And uh, another, nice. another copy of Alan Wake. 
which still has not shot up in price, uh, strangely enough. I thought it would, being s I'm sure all the music licensing is running out. And it's a fracking great game, right? <sighs> I'm glad to see you're spending money on all this stuff. Hey, all this stuff at the new thrift store is only 20 bucks in total. And uh, money. I've had luck selling this, this edition of Trivia Pursuit before, if it's complete with the one ring. And uh, they had this taped close at the store. Like, I'm not going to check it. Give me a break. So I have a knife on me when I go thrifting. And uh, so I had to check it. So everything looks pretty much here and unmolested. So there you go. Cool. All right. Thanks for your contribution, Joe. I know uh, I'm really surprised you actually didn't have any stuff. Am I allowed to leave now and go outside? Considering all the content that we see at a com uh, competitor website. But uh, thanks for your help uh, in narration. On Am this I video. allowed to eat now and go get some food? Well, you've been eating all day. And uh, see some sunlight? How about a wide shot so we can have a good thumbnail Yeah, with your dry toast? Excellent. Thanks, everybody. We'll catch you on the on the other side. Flip your flop. No, I I stop saying that. Oh, yeah, the other side. Good. Good.